I always felt like, even though I had two seasons to play and going through this season through scrims, I, I'm still trying to pick things up and you're still trying to learn. I can only imagine, you know, coming in here, you, you got to take what you already know and then work on it. It's training. It's on the job training. It's pretty intense trial by fire. And with these guys are concerned, I, I think they just need to tell themselves that they believe in each other and they got to play. They got to live in the moment and play off any mistakes that they make. And the big thing that I was going to get at, what's unique about the Dallas? SGs are they all know each other pretty well wise guys so I think it should they should be able to take that advantage to at least play some kind of coherent rotation and just follow up and we'll try to support their own team that way I do expect that out of them tonight uh, and then y y you can hear me right yeah, yeah, Magic was asking we good, and I said 19 more seconds. Oh man, Every yep. everyone's on the line for the burn. They're very complacent, wise guy. I really think the burn should be more aggressive here. Oh. Off the bat, NYC 12 take the lead thanks to Magic's mid aerial supremacy. Oh my god, and what a goal by Magic! Now, do we have the sound? The sound, the sound issue is taken care of. Big goal by Magic, another hot start for this New York City team, just like that 1 0 goal, New York City. As looks like Pundit wins that kickoff and it's going to the wall. Dak gonna try to equalize it immediately. Yanni knocks it away, and again, Alan, we talked about this defending off the bat for New York City. Meanwhile, Magic over right there, knocked away wide by Wansboro. We talked about the defending by New York City. As strong as the attack's been, this, this, this defending has been absolutely top-notch. It's all about playing by the book. Just covering oh. your team, driving right to the right side of the field. Fire Pulsa. Fire Pulsa scores it! Go, New York City! Big cross Ooh. by Yanni. Magic just knocks it down and fire Pulsa there on a second chance shot. Wansboro just cannot reach it. A big start, a big two quick goals for New York City. What really helps is, and I think what the burn needs to address here, is they need cars to be able to challenge the ball. It makes your defending job way easier when the other team is just playing too far apart and not looking for the pass, which Fire Pulse is telling me is a big must for any team. He almost got that one. Yanni right there. Can you knock this one in? Yanni, oh, just high of the crossbar. Magic with the finish, and Punish is going to knock it away. And yeah, we talk about, you know, just and just, just the cohesiveness. We talk about the burn kind of be inexperienced magic, right? To try and knock it in. Blue spark, and he wanna get the Yanni is gonna knock it just right to the corner. Magic gonna play off the wall now. Pun is gonna knock it back and try to put in the clear. Fire pulse, can he get him and drop in? It's gonna go just high and wide. Physical what play. A start. I love to see it. What a start for of an incredibly strong start for New York City. Yanni now gonna try to play it back to the ground. Wansboro right there is gonna go just wide. Net deck! He's gonna go oh just missed it! Oh, oh that could that's a big a big missed opportunity for for the burn to put to pull one back. New York City 12 doing a nice job not letting that into the own goal. That was a huge opportunity and 12 still defending this ball. Magic to game back late, but look at him. They're trying to work a passing lane here. A little bit double committing right there. Seems like they kinda got mm -hmm. it down. Mayo Fire Pulsar. Dak can he get his one to drop in? Magic's gonna tap it away. Wansberg gonna try to settle it down. Fire Pulse is gonna challenge him and win it. Yanni, can you get this one to go? Pundit's gonna knock it back to the wall. It seems it looks like Dallas has kind of settled down since the, since the opening minute. Now the question is, can they get one back, or will New York City add a third halfway through game one? It's not just the positioning. I feel like it is the speed. New York City 12 is using their mechanical prowess and just their confidence to drive. They missed that one. And that's the difference. I still see the burn needing to overcome. Oh, here's the opportunity. And magic right there. Can you get in? Guess who? It's magic. Go, New York City. 
That's exactly what I was saying. They drive really fast so they can cover the ball. Imagine getting the strike. I know a certain somebody on the old New York City 12 who was able to finish a few of these, if I could say so myself, Jeff. Well, I believe it might be the Platt legend himself who could finish a few of them. And maybe, and maybe with the other five. <laughs> Mio Wanko yeah. wins the kickoff on this one. <laughs> Here he comes. Uh, trust me, if it, between you and me, I would, probably miss, I would probably miss all 10 of those chances. It's not even close. Magic can try to get his one far post. Mm. Dax can knock it back to midfield and knock it back towards New York City's corner. An insanely strong start. Another big, strong game one start for New York City. Taking advantage of a new, really a new and inexperienced Dallas Burns side. Yeah, oh, Fireballs are going to carry this one it. in. Watch oh. it in. The captain scores. Go, New York City. Yeah, And really just doing himself. They were trying to string something together. They had the ball in New York City 12's territory, and then they just lost track of that and possibly just snuck in. That's how you know New York City 12 is on high gear. 4-0 in game one, and we still have just under two minutes left to play. How much more damage can New York City do? Can Burn just score one just to get any kind of momentum to get in this series? Magic could knock it back in the corner. One throw nearly get that mad shot. Fire Pulsa, drop it in. Go, New York City! 5 0. When it rains, it pours. Wandsboro with the in that got smoked. Fire Pulse just read that. That's just a combination of expertise and confidence in playing, wise guy. This is absolute dominance by New York City right now. 5 0, a minute and a half left here in game number one. There's still two games left. Oh, goodness. You know what's interesting when you think about it? When you're, when you're a new team, you really don't you don't know what to expect, and you know you have your scrims, and you probably do well during the week or in, in between matches whenever you get whenever you grind. But to come into a match against an attack like this and just thinking maybe, and then just and then just have that kind of start, it has to be deflating, doesn't it? I didn't Speaking of deflating, my, Magic, the Magic Show in high gear, go New York City. Right from the good range, and he gets the perfect, perfect angle of the wall to set a magic. Who reads it so well? The passes are coming together in New York City 12. Je to your point, wise guy. I've been in that situation where we played uh, the Tigers, we played uh, Los Verdes, and Viking Army from season two. It is, but the reality is. All, it's all about fixing what you can fix, looking back at the tape, and then I don't see the burn are too far off in terms of being competitive. As we see New York City Talk trying to mount another one, and the burn trying to counter here. And again, you got to keep in mind, the chemistry's on, on point right there. Oh my goodness, what a finish. Right. Oh, Magic set him up. The captain finishes. Go, New York City. 7-0 with still 39 seconds left to play. Oh, that's just literally not able to do it. The first touch is pretty much the guy who whiffs first is probably the having the most uh, contrived response. It probably should have gotten that. But in all honesty, this is through and through a, a game that New York City 12 had control of. I, I feel like the burn just needs to be able to take this into the. Oh man, another man. one for the 12. Oh, another goal for the captain. Goal, New York City. Looks like there may be a little bit of lag, but oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, that was that was a very pandering s goal, if I may say so myself. And we've seen some pandering s goals. Yeah, Magic is feeling it. I wouldn't blame him because this is a feel of a team that is putting the standards on themselves to win as many series as possible and really and not even make the goal differential a factor. Oh, here comes a good set down to the middle. I wonder if the counter's going to come here finally for the burn. Oh, just short on the aerial. Manuel Pundit misses the save. Yoani right there trying to set something up. Magic, can he finish it? Magic can just drop in the far corner. Oh, just off the crossbar. Fire post, he can't get a far post. Pundit, Pundit knocks it away. Big save. Oh, just to avoid a ninth goal. My goodness. Ah, uh, do we even need to say it? New York City 12 takes game one absolutely easily. One, one nil in the series. They take game one, eight nothing. Ladies and gents, we'll be right back. Don't go away. Game two, right around the corner. Stay tuned. After dominant game one for New York City, what do they have for game two? As Dax is going to win this kickoff, Yanni tried to get the fast kickoff and just whiffed it. And gets kind of gets away with it a little bit. Ooh. Maybe a sloppy start for New York City right there. Yanni could knock this one away. And a better start in the attack by the burn after that 8-0 slacking in game one by New York City. 
And literally all you can do after you have it, and if you can't respond in the game, just respond in the intermission where you, you all collected, you're gonna go back to your reflexes and just trust in that it's gonna be different. Ooh, you almost missed that one in the clear. I will say this is a better start for the burn who have not allowed a goal in the first 35 seconds in game one, in game two. My goodness. Oh, here Magic it comes down to the Magic, point. Magic, Magic look working at the wall. Wansbo, a good challenge by Wansbo. Knock it away. Yep. Big demo back there by Pun from Pundit to Yanni. But uh, F's in chat. Pundit, can you knock Whoa. it in? Almost hey. big save by Yanni. He came in from the far post. I think that's what helped him with the save. He got lucky there. Oh, and almost another a second chance goal for, for Dallas right there. Magic, oh, can he walk this one in? Dak knocks it away. Big save. Big stop right there. Magic with a shot on goal. Yanni, gonna, this ball's going to go high. And we get to it, Magic right there, knock it wide. A better start for Dallas in this one. And this, this may be the one concern for New York City. We've seen this in game, we saw this in the, in the, in the season opener, where they will have a, such a strong start and kind of tail off a bit in, game, in, 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 in the middle games. Is there an inside joke in the scrims, the weeknight scrims that we do, wise guy, where everybody just starts to sandbag, like we're trolling low key? I, I'm not sure I'm seeing that in this game. I just feel like uh, the burn is just getting in some good rhythm. They're not positioning something crazy. They're hitting a lot more of their shots. So I well, give them a lot of credit on that. Meanwhile, this guy. one nearly dropped in for Magic. Dax gonna knock yep. it wide. Magic right there, gonna get it back to the wall. Yanni gonna try to keep the ball in play inside. Dallas is half fire. Pulse to the net. Big save by Wansboro. <laughs> Dax can knock it back to the wall. Almost the first goal of the match for New York City. I want to see that save again. That was really dazzling stuff there. In the clutch. Magic can try to get underneath. No. Five poster just whiffs on the, on, on the second chance ball. Pundit can try to play it on, on the off just close to the wall now. Yanni can try to back it up. Wansberg can keep keep control. Dak can he get the aerial. He whiffs on the aerial. Free ball to the corner. Five poster can he get to it. There it is. Goal, New York City. The captain makes it 1-0 in game two. It looks easy, wise guy, but this one is not. He did not really have the angle, and once Rowe jumped, maybe would have gotten it on, but that's on Fire Pulse's hustle to make it a 1-0 game. And finally, the breakthrough for New York City in game number two. 1-0, halfway through game number two in this one. Meanwhile, Dak, can you get the equalizer right there? Magic big save! I love what I saw there. That was a close one. Oh, that was almost the... At, Dallas has gotten very close to, to, to scoring their first goal of the series, let alone equalizing in this game or taking the lead early on. They have gotten really close to scoring. And I'm not sure if that's going to be a concern for New York City going forward, but it has to be on the back of the mind. It's still only a 1-0 game. Anything can happen. You and I have seen it. You can be down four in the final minute and still come back to win. So this game is far from over. Yanni almost... Fire poster almost again with a goal. There it is. Goal, New York City. The captain makes it a brace. Miles Bell on the bangersonly.com radar gun. Hey, Jeff, the speed is low, but so are the prices at bangersonly.com. Keep in mind, it's not about how hard you bang it. It's about, just get, it's about getting it in. Know what I mean? 2-0, New York City. Into the final two minutes of this one. <laughs> Longo gives it to Dak. There it is. 2-1, goal, burn. Dallas burn on the board with a very well done cross off the board, wise guy. I like that a lot. 68 miles per hour. How's that on the bangersonly.com radar gun? Hey, anything, anything you can bang, I can bang harder. Know what I mean? 2-1, New York City. And this just became, might have just became a game. Can New York City get a pull back up two again? Magic, try to make something happen in the air. The ball's going to stay towards the ceiling. Wansbro's gonna miss it. Firepost is gonna miss it. Free ball to the corner. Free ball to the corner. Now Yanni, can he get control of it? And Wansbro's gonna win the challenge. Ball in the middle. Can anyone get to it? Pundit's gonna knock it back to the corner. New York City, a little bit of desperation. A little bit of double committing that corner now. Pundit's gonna knock it back. And it looks like Burns gonna play it back. Yanni right now trying to get off and off the wall. Knocked away by Wansbro. Back to the wall. And you have to give Dallas a lot of credit. This is a much closer game than game one. It's, it seems like they, they might have woken up a little bit. They've definitely been hitting the ball so much better. I see the team play over here. And Magic's going to go for it. Oh. Almost. The Magic show yet to make the appearance in game number two so far. But what a start in game one. I'll tell you that much. Yanni right now playing in middle of the field. Pundit going to give chase. Going to play it off the wall. If they're bounced, can we get it? Wansboro. Wansboro kind of kills that challenge just a little bit. 
And Dak will knock it back towards New York City's half. Magic now going to play it down. Wansbro now towards New York City's corner. Can they get the equalizer here? Yanni trying to get out of the way. Just can't fully clear it. Five Pulse can help him out. And this ball is going to go back towards Dallas's half. Five Pulse trying to play the corner. Five Pulse again. They want to get to the middle. No one there. Both Magic and Yanni tracking back. Magic can get it back into Dallas's half now, right now. And really, it doesn't. It, it, I don't know. I don't know if it's Dallas just playing better in this game, or if just New York City is just not finding the same kind of chances they did in game number one. But this is a way closer game. Look, New York City could win this one 2-1, one, unless unless Dallas makes something happen here in the final five seconds. Can they finish this one? Yeah. Can That's they good. finish this one? Three. Ball's gonna cross to the corner. Three, two, one. Ball in the middle. Dangerous ball. Wandsburg right there is gonna hit the ground. That's gonna do it. A close one. But it's still another win for New York City. 12 will go up 2-0 in the series. Taking game two, 2-1. Two to one. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll see if New York City 12 can get the sweep. We will take a quick break and be right back. Stay tuned. Game three, underway. And it's five posts that wins the opening kickoff. That was a good counter. No passing lane, though. Really? Magic can play it off the wall. Punter going to knock it back. And again, a little bit... A little... Bit similar to what we saw in game two from Dallas, where he's trying to play, play the wide game and just not allow New York City those chances over the middle. That's a great word for it. Discipline, just they didn't give any silly balls away and they hit a lot better. I, I can tell the difference. So now it's putting big doubts as to whether the sweep will happen. Bernie with a good opportunity here. Pondiga knocked away. Good save. Second ball. Magic fire post. Excuse me right there. Knock it back to the corner. Almost an opening goal for New York City. Yanni going to try to play this one over the middle. Can anyone get there? He's going to be knocked away to the ceiling. Five poles are going to finish it off the crossbar. Almost the opening game three for New York City. Yanni, can this one get in? Wansbro, big save. Five poles now trying to play back. It's going to be just above the crossbar. Magic just misses that one. Once again, the Burns got to defend. Oh, that's the opportunity that that's they can't give New York City 12 right there. But the Burn recover nicely. A very dangerous ball for Dallas. A very dangerous ball. Almost... That could, that almost should have been a goal for this New York City side. This boy gonna oh. walk in, Pundit! Wow. Dallas has their first lead of the game. First lead of the series, excuse me. One nil, burn. Well played by Pundit. I do not know if that's the matter of the lag or just the fact that if the fire pulse are coming from the other side of the post, not closing it, may have been a big difference. What a moment for the Dallas burn, wise it looks guy. Like he just, it looks like he just missed it. What well, should have been yep. almost a routine save, you would think, for him. But just like Absolutely that, you know, agree. we're talking mistakes. Yanni trying to get one back right away. It's going to go just wide. And we're talking no mistakes. In this game, it just takes one mistake to really change, not just a game, but a series. Magic, can you get this one to drop in? It's going to go just high. Pundit and Edak on the, on the on the defending. Ball into the corner. Yanni, fire pulls it, trying to get something, trying to get something, but good ball. Magic, can you get this one to drop in? No, Dax can knock it wide. Yanni right there, dangerous ball. Can he finish it? Fire pulls her. The captain equalizes. Go, New York City. This, kids, is exactly why you need to implement bumping and demoing in your arsenal. Just magic knowing that the cars are far apart. I think he did get a shoulder in there, and this is a tied game. Just like that, we are tied. 1-1. One, one. This New York City punt is going to win that kickoff easy. Another whiff kickoff for New York City. Maybe something to consider going forward. Magic and plays one back to the wall. Dangerous ball over the middle. And Wansbro just knocks it wide. No one there to, to take it. Nearly a double commit. Yanni now can try to walk this and try to get this one in. Ball's just too far from him. Pundit can't get to it. Five poles can try to play it in the corner. Yanni can track back. Magic now. Gonna play it back to the wall. Dax can try to take control of it off the wall. Trying to play it back to his New York City half. Anyone's game. We're nearly halfway through game number three. New York City looking for the sec. For the first back-to-back -back sweep. Yanni was just going to drop in. Yanni, his first in the series. Go, New York City. You know, wise, wise guy, Firepulse and I talk about this, about how you don't want to drive all the way back for the big boost, but Yanni pulled it off so well. He drove all the way up the wall, and he pinched it to the side to get New York City 12 the lead. The rotations have been absolutely on point for New York City, not just in this game, but really if you look at the entire season so far, rotationally, they've been, for the most part, incredibly solid. And probably the best we've seen out of this club ever. With all due respect to you, of course. New York City 12 is playing with so much confidence. I believe Yanni just d deliberately whiffed that kickoff just to position themselves better. I, I think they're playing with a ton of uh, undue confidence, New York City 12 are. The burn might be encouraged by this. So far, it's working. New York City leading 2 to 1, entering the final two minutes of game number three. New York City looking to finish a sweep up two, up two games and nothing in the series. 
Can they get a third one? A third one here would go a long way. Yanni trying to get that far post shot. Knocked away by Dak. Wansberg gonna knock it back. Far post again. Get it in. No. Magnificent saves by the runner. They just keep stacking up. That's a fifth save combined for the Dallas burn. Fire pulse now can try to work this one to the corner. Dak can try to place off the wall. Can't get to it. Magic can try to place it to the corner. Can anyone get to the middle? And Wansberg can knock it back to the corner. And Magic can get the shot. Nothing there. Dak can knock it back. Fire pulse. Uh! Oh my, take a bow, young man. Go on, New York City. And wise guy, 10 seconds ago, you see how that goal transpired. It was the hit before Dak when they just kept the ball and they couldn't pass it out. And New York City 12's absolutely going to take advantage of those moments to score. What well, could be a huge goal for NYC 12 to finish this sweep. 3-1 in the final, with about a minute 40 left. Yachty, and try to place one off the wall. Looks like that, that was just missed that one again. Magic, can he dunk it in? Oh, the Magic Show is live in game three. Go, New York City. 64 miles per hour, and the bangersonly.com radar gun. Magic is just nailing the aerials today, and he's rewarded nicely. A, a pro probably the nail in the coffin for New York City 12, and Magic, Magic once again coming through big. 4-1 entry was about just under a minute and a half left in game number three. Looks like and New York City's gonna finish the speed. Fire poster, magic and the caveat in! Ho ho! The, the magic show gets a brace. Go, New York City! Wise well, guy, I don't really recommend this kind of double committing, but if a real Grand Valley stamp, he can pull it off. I mean New York City 12 and Magic and Yanni and Fire Pulsa can too. The floodgates are opening for NYC 12. 5-1 to one as we enter the final minute. And Wansbro wins the kickoff. Nearly got a goal off the kick. That goes just wide of the post. Could have been a bit of a momentum burn right there. Five post could knock this one wide. Almost sneaks in and gets to the crossbar. Yanni tried to get, tried to get that, that, that angle shot. Couldn't get to it. Dax can knock it back to the wall. Magic. Final minute of this one. Magic can get this one. No. Five post is going to go just over him. Fire Pulse can try to get in control. Fire Pulse can try to carry it in. Can he drop it in? Oh my! Go, New York City! 6 1. Pop quiz class. What is it you need to implement in your Rocket League play to be effective? The bumping. Magic with the assist indirectly. It's 6 1 for New York, wise guy. Don't be afraid to bump, kids. 48 seconds left. This one all but over. The fat lady, fat lady is warming up her, her pipes. 6 1. And what, what looks like the first set of back-to-back -back sweeps for, new, for NYC 12 in club history. And probably the most dominant back-to-back -back sweeps we've seen. I, I mean, I just, I'm speechless at this attack. This attack is absolutely dominant. I mean, we see it week in, week out, and day in, day out, really. But when you see it live against live, when you see it live, it's just absolutely fun to watch. Wise guy, you don't argue against effectiveness. I mean, this team doesn't make every single shot. They don't turn every opportunity into a goal, but they just reliably stay in control no matter what. And they take advantage of the chaos. Here it comes. Another, another one for Magic. Go, New York City. 7 1. Let's book that trip to Brazil, wise guy, through bangersonly.com. Oh, we had to have to Brazil. We had to have the Brazil scoreline. 7-1, New York City 12, and this is all but over. New York City 12, 3-0 in the season. Back-to-back -back sweeps, they have won six. They have won seven straight matches dating back to game five against Nashville. And that will complete the sweep. New York City 12 wins 3-0. When we get back, we will have the Magic Show live in post-game. Stay tuned.